Jim Dale is an exciting sort of production. It's an exciting sort of venture into Jim's life. He's basically put together his life story in the form of a show. The origin of this show goes back quite a few years. I remember arriving in New York City in 1973 to do a play called Scapino. And uh, I said to my friend at the time, I must do a one-man show one day. Now that was on my mind in 1973. And, and since then, there's been 40 extra years that, uh, that have happened. He is a natural-born storyteller. He comes out of the tradition of the British Music Hall, which is all about stories, comedy, physical bits. Jim is a performer and he's an entertainer and he's a storyteller. Uh, and Jim has great stories. It contains in it lovely memories of what the old days used to be like. And it also gives them an idea of this particular business called show business, where, well, what it's like to be a disc jockey, what it's like to be a pop singer, what it's like to be a narrator, what it's like to be a stand-up comic, what it's like to be a straight actor. And so all of these things come into various stories throughout the evening. And I think at the end of it, they, they have a better understanding of this tree called show business than they had before. Jim tells stories from his childhood, back when he first sort of ventured into the world of comedy and uh, sort of pop, as well as uh, he tells stories about uh, books that he's done on tape uh, and his Broadway career. Jim is such a great showman. He will connect with audiences immediately. You feel like he's just welcoming you into his space and having a conversation with you. So even though he's this larger than life performer in a lot of ways, it's also going to be I think extremely intimate. He's so personable and he really wants to connect with each person in the room. I've been playing this show out of New York to a few theaters and uh, if the audience reaction at the roundabout is the same as we've been getting out of town then I will be so thrilled. One of the things that makes Jim Dale so special is his ability to perform in so many different styles, so many different genres, and not every actor has that skill set. Oh, this is quite fun to be back. I mean, I've seen so many old faces. This is the fifth production I will have done for the Roundabout Theatre, and uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing the same faces for the next 12 weeks. Mm -hmm.